Right, so let's see how the shadows work for axonometrics. Let's take this standard box in an axonometric, right? So all lines are parallel. Let's consider how this would look like in shadow and lighting. Well, in axonometrics, uh, in axonometrics, the uh, standard yeah, sun rays they fall at a 60 degree angle and at a horizontal direction, right? So they don't you don't want them to like fall like on the same direction as the axes right you want to fold them to make them fall at a different angle okay so it's 60 degrees and a horizontal so now the question boils down to how do we find out which faces need shadows and which depth well how many faces does a box have six right so how many of these six are directly hit by light and how many are there in shadow so this is lit right because it's directly hit by light again considering this angle and direction this is lit right again directly hit by light this is in shadow right because it's not directly hit by light so this is got volume shadow like it's a shadowed face right it's it's got uh, it's got shadow. What about this face here? It's lit as well, the back side one. What about the bottom one? This is shadow again, because it's not directly hit by light. And the back one here is shadow as well, right? So we got three and three, right? So, let's see. Where would these uh, 60, degree, uh, 60 degree and uh, horizontal face, uh, sorry, 60 degree and a horizontal direction uh, shadows fall? Well, well, not on the base, because the base is horizontal, it's on the ground level, so it's not casting any shadow. So you just got these two faces. How many vertical edges do these faces have? Uh, three, because one is common. So we got a 60 degree and a horizontal, 60 degree and a horizontal, 60 degree and a horizontal. Right? Okay. And we project them, and these are our shadow points. And we need to connect them now. Right. To get our cast shadow. We connect them and we get, end up having this shape. We thicken its contour and this is the cast shadow for our prism. Okay. Boom. Let's go.